I was the science kid, very hands-on. I was taking things apart, much to my parents' chagrin, uh, not always being able to put them back together, but I was, the, I was the classic science kid. I do basic science research to try and come up with new cures to help patients that I'll never meet, but I also wanted to help patients that I would meet, and that's what attracted me to being a doctor. I like the fact that I can use my knowledge and my skill to directly change a patient's life. That's what makes me the happiest about being a doctor. The consequences of vascular disease are unfortunately serious. It's amputation, stroke, or death. And when we prevent that, and you walk out there, and you talk to the family, and later you talk to the patient, that great feeling, it never goes away. Heart and vascular disease is serious, and patients understand that. And they're often seeking advice on the internet, from family, from friends, from their doctor, about where to go. Here at the University of Maryland Medical Center, we do everything from vein surgery in our new outpatient suite, which is done without anesthesia, just local anesthetic, and the patient literally gets up and walks off the operating room table and can go back to work that day all the way to complex problems that other vascular surgeons have looked at and said, we can't do this. We're not at the University of Maryland Medical Center. You need to go to the University of Maryland Medical Center for this. There's lots of different ways to treat a vascular problem, and we have all of them here. I get all my health care at the University of Maryland Medical Center, and in the Heart and Vascular Center, I have full confidence in our dedicated specialists who offer the latest treatment, and I do tell all my family and friends to come here for any vascular or heart issue. Trust the experts at the University of Maryland Heart and Vascular Center.